Let's go. The Oracle is hiding inside. I'll finally get some answers. for the Pythia. See that asshole? No one's come this way. Don't let up. They're here, somewhere. Got it. Well, what do you see? Nothing. They're still here. Keep looking. Don't worry. They can't hide forever. You spotted them yet? I don't see a thing. Keep looking. I want them found. They'll regret coming here.
from this. here to hurt you. I just want answers. The Pythia is a sacred vessel of the gods. People travel the world for my answers. But none of them would dare break into my home. Apollo's wrath will be cruel and swift. Guards! I'm looking for my family. And everywhere I go, people are either lying or trying to kill me. You're the first person who might have some answers. But they'll kill me if I tell you. Not if I get to them first. Help me, and no harm will come to you, I promise. All right. But ask your questions quickly. The longer you're here, the more at risk we both are. 
What is this cult of Cosmos? They are the eyes that see, but go unseen. Enough with the riddles! I want names! I don't know! I swear! They hide behind masks and shrouds! Why would you work for the cult? I have no choice. So, all those prophecies from the gods... All those people... You're paid to deceive them all? Most want to know about love or death. I tell them what they want to hear. But when people want to know about war or politics, I'm paid very well to tell them what the cult wants them to hear. You said you saw me in your visions. What did you see? There is an artifact under the temple of Apollo. It reveals what only the gods should know. You called me the child on the mountain. The cult hunts a Spartan child who survived a terrible fall from Mount Taietos. The artifact revealed that child to be you. You have an opportunity to do the right thing. Tell me where to find the cult. Tell me where they are, or we'll go find them together. Beneath the Temple of Apollo, there is an ancient chamber. I think they meet there. But without one of their cloaks and masks, you won't make it more than two steps inside. Where can I find one of these cloaks and masks? There is a man. He visits me from time to time, makes sure I'm well taken care of. I have the biggest house in the Hora of Delphi, yet he still offers Drachmi for my troubles. <sighs> Gives me the creeps. What's his name? Elpinor. Elpinor? He's with the cult? I can't be sure. But if he is, he would definitely have what you require. I sent Elpinor to the Underworld. I knew the mask I stripped from his corpse would come in handy. May Apollo protect you. I should tell Herodotus what Epithea told me about the cult. Maybe he'll have some insight. the Pythia tell you? The cult of Cosmos is hunting me. But I'm going to hunt them first. She told me they meet in a secret chamber under the Temple of Apollo. So it's all true. If the cult has done anything, it's fooled this old man. I've killed the first cultist, Elpinor. A snake I met in Kefalonia. His mask and cloak will get me inside the chamber. So they're underneath the Temple of Apollo? Yes, by the cave of Yea. I think I know the place. Find it, and I'll meet you there.
So this is the secret. So, this is it. Hidden chamber of the cultists. Here, all along. I'm going inside. Keep my clothes for me? Best not to go in with your weapons, either. I don't think they'll look too kindly on that. How do I look? Terrifying. Good. Find me once you've found out the truth in there. Keep your wits about you. Try not to do anything rash. Me? Rash? These ridiculous costumes were a good idea. You're late! Very late! It's a good thing Vimos hasn't arrived yet. Sorry, it's my... First time. A new recruit? <gasps> welcome, welcome! There's a lot of people here. All share our common mind. Good. We're here to evaluate the strides taken by the cult since the last meeting. We haven't met for some, some time. Where did they come from? The land and across the seas, we assemble as a community. Here, there is no war. There are no sides. You mentioned someone. Vimos. Who is that? You'll learn his name very, very quickly. He's our leader. I'm sure he believes that, but no. He's our weapon. He's difficult, but he does important work for us. I don't envy his position one bit. I'll go talk to the others. Thank you. Yes, yes, before Demos comes. Who knows if you'll get a word in after that. Only blood right now, but who knows? Lemos may ask for our hands next. Go on, go on, make your offering. We just have to keep our sights on what the bloodline will do for us. The bloodline? The mother, the father, the sister, you know, his kin. We need them, all of them. To use them. That information is not for Vemos, of course. You know how volatile he is. He could rip through us easily. I'll be sure to keep it to myself. As you should. Nor can he know we're about to capture his mother. <laughs> Do what with her? I would lower my voice if I were you. Just know she will be put to good use unless she's uncontrollable. You know where she is? No, but it won't be long until we do, I assure you. She's the cult's next target. Tell me about Demos. He's shown us what we need to know. He's a machine, a weapon for the cult. Someone that unstable can't be trusted with such personal information. I have to go. To our great ambition. To ambition. I'll need much more information to identify who these cultists are. You're not are. listening. I'm still not convinced. You. We need another opinion on this. Why split the resources searching for a woman we can't find? 
If we narrow our focus, Athens will be ours. Immediate threats have to be destroyed. Pericles has to be destroyed. Not without the mother. We aren't strong enough without the mother. Don't let Vimos hear that. If anything, we should be hunting the father. <sighs> we know who the mother is. Looking for the father would be a waste of resources. What do you think? Hunt the champion's mother or his father? The mother, she's right. Get your priorities straight. Before you know it, Pericles will shore up his defenses and we will have lost our chance. Now, if you'll excuse me. I hear you perfectly well. You're just wrong. You need to look for the father. Why they face so sad, like the tragic mask of Melpomene? Your family is safe for now. Just, just don't touch them. Don't hurt them. That is up to you, but I know you behave because you know their fates if you don't. Please, don't. We will kill them, your wife, your child, and then what would you have to live for? Nothing. Exactly. yourself together, Malaka. You're a fucking pig before slaughter. I'll do it, I swear. I'll kill him. Let me go. You like to watch, you sick fuck. You're not just going to watch. You're going to teach this little insolent shit a lesson. Does he deserve it? Does it fucking matter, does it? What I say goes! No questions asked! I... I couldn't do it! But I'm not scared. Not anymore. If you can't kill a fucking Archon, what are you gonna do when I tell you to kill a fucking Archon? I will! I will! I'll kill Fidias! I... Show him what happens to cowards. They get fucking burned! Hand it to me. <laughs> no! No! <laughs> More? No. I'll go to Athens. I'll stake out the temple. I'll kill him. Good. And don't waste my fucking time again. Fuck up like that again, and I'll draw blood! Now get the fuck out of here before I get this traitor's blood on your bones! You, son of a spotted going into your house! and from the cult. Gods, they have a foothold in every part of the Greek world. We're in more danger than I thought. I still 
strange. I feel something. Towards the pyramid. It's covered in shards like Alpinos. had the last piece. Now it is ready. Every time I see it, it calls to me and sings of power. Does it call to you like it calls to me? It does. What are you doing? Have you lost your mind? I... No. My great warrior hasn't even arrived yet. Gather yourself and hold your tongue, fool. Show respect for the bloodline. Pinor is dead. One of you is a traitor. The artifact will expose them. You! Ah! Everyone. Ah. 
Oh, you're alive. There were people in the temple. I couldn't see their faces. They... Herodotus. They control all of the Greek world. Everything. I see. It's worse than I thought. There's more. They have a weapon. What kind? A soldier. Stronger and more ferocious than any I've ever seen. Herodotus... It's my brother. We need to get to Athens. Athens? We need to find my mother. My clothes. Spear. Uh, uh, of course. My spear! Cult of Cosmos called my brother Demos. He used an artifact to see my memories. Cassandra, the man I serve, we must tell him what's happened before it's too late. You've heard the name Pericles before. Pericles is the great general leading the Delian League against the Spartans. They say he's ruthless. We aren't leading the League against anyone. Pericles is a man of peace. This war was thrust upon him. Upon us all. A general who doesn't want war? Not likely. Save your doubts. He is working to end this war. We all are. If there are forces colluding against him, he must be warned. We have to go. Well, you weren't there, Irodotos. The cult controls everything. There's no stopping them. Which is why you cannot turn away. They want to destroy all of the Greek world with this war. I won't be some pawn in your scheme, Irodotos. Don't do it for me, then. Do it for your mother. If there is one place where we can find information about your mother, it is in Athens. How? Pericles surrounds himself with the brightest minds in Athens, which is to say anywhere. In Athens, you can fulfill your duty to your family. But before we can go, I need you to meet me at the Lion of Leonidas, at Thermobile. Leonidas? Why? There's something I need to know. Something that may help us take down this cult and save your mother. You've proven I can trust you, but let's make it quick, Irodotos. First, Thermopylae. Then we go to Athens. I'll make sure every single one of these cultists dies by my hands. Cosmos demands to know the secrets hiding in the hearts of men, so I simply cut them open. Slaves understand you better when you carve your rules into the backs of their heads. <laughs> What's one life worth without a thousand others behind it? Who needs democracy when Thrakmi rules the world?
I spent 20 years at sea, only to realize the cult was my home. The fight is only over when I am the last man left standing. Chaos is our greatest strength. The cult is nothing without me. Even the gods cower in my wake. Kneel or die. Path of betrayal. This is where that traitor snuck the Persian army past Sparta's defenses. Feels as if I'm betraying Sparta too. Come <laughs> on. 
for this fight. I've heard stories of Leonidas. I can't believe I'm finally seeing where history was made. I will follow the most to the underworld and bring my hordes with us.
They say you can't walk this battlefield without getting blood on your toes. This is where Leonidas was laid to rest. I wish I had known him. If you close your eyes, you can hear them. Their final war cries. Before every last one of those brave Spartans perished. Their voices were silenced that day. But their story will be sung for an eternity. You didn't bring me here to talk about dead Spartans. What's on your mind, Herodotus? The Battle of Thermopylae still echoes in our hearts. But to stand here is to feel it in your bones. There's nothing here but ghosts. My concerns are with the living. Hold out your spear. My spear? What for? I need to know something. I'm fine. I'm fine. The stories are true. That is the spear of Leonidas. The hero's blade. Where were Sparta's allies? The Spartans weren't alone in facing Xerxes and his hordes. Many from across the Greek world were armed and ready to fight alongside Leonidas and his 300. But when the mighty king looked into their eyes and saw fear, he sent them home. That sounds like madness, not bravery. It was foretold by the Pythia that Sparta would lose either its freedom or its king to the Persians. Leonidas made his choice. What happened to Leonidas after the battle? Xerxes was famous for honoring warriors who fought valiantly against the Persians. But Leonidas infuriated him so much, he cut off his head and impaled it on a pike. A bloody battle ensued, and his remains were reclaimed by the Spartans and buried here. Now, however, he rests where he belongs. In Sparta. What happened to the traitor, Ephialtes? King Xerxes paid him well, but treachery breeds treachery. A contract was put on his head, and he died as he lived, 
a coward. You knew this would happen. I didn't know, but I did suspect. There is a place I'd convinced myself was a dream. Until now. A peculiar structure on the island of Andros. Mysterious shapes carved in stone. Like nothing I've ever seen. You want to sail to Andros so you can show me shapes? In my travels, I heard whispers of an ancient civilization. A people who came before. Your spear and that place are connected. You mentioned the people that came before. Who were they? They were not gods, but they lived far longer than any mortal and were far more intelligent. I've seen carvings in caves, strange symbols that suggest it was this ancient civilization that created humankind and provided them with fire. But Zeus blamed Prometheus. Yes. Well, perhaps his eagle has been feasting on the wrong liver. The spear awakened to you, Irodotos. I trust you. You understand. I will do everything in my power to help you find your mother. I promise. But first, we must sail to the island of Andros. I'll meet you at my ship. Welcome aboard the Adrestia, Irodotos. Will you be traveling with us? Only for a short trip. I have business to attend to in Athens. Irodotos is helping me find my mother. Seeking help from the gods has put Irodotos... ...on your path, just like they put you on mine. They work in ways beyond our comprehension. And all we can do is follow their lead. You could be right. Hirovatos and I share enemies too. Like in Pinor? He is... was... part of a very powerful group called the Cult of Cosmos that controls the Greek world through the Oracle. Control the Oracle? Impossible! Apollo would not allow that! Now they're looking for my mother. I need to find her before they do. I believe they will hurt others who oppose them.
I see them. Off we go now. was definitely not a first kill. You!
Here they are. Bit of blood on them, but the sapphires still shine. I have a ship, a good one. What I need is a crew. Are you in?
Off we go now.
What kind of elixir uses ingredients like this? Tell you what, you have to scare it away. If you roar like a lion, it'll run. <laughs> Good job. Now run along home. You must be a physician. Yes, I'm Lycaon. You must be a Mystheus. Are you here for treatment? That depends. Will I have to roar for you too? Sometimes the best medicine I can give my patients is a dose of hope. I take it you're not in need of care. I'm healthy as a horse. You look strong and prepared for anything. My patients need mandrake herbs. There's a part of them growing by a little stream southeast of here. Are you too busy to pick them? Too chewy. A pack of wolves is resting near the stream. I'll pay you generously for your trouble. You know how to talk to Amistios. Is that all you want? The mandrake herbs? For now. Bring them back to me, and I'll pack at them for my patients. Then we'll see. I'll bring you the herbs. You said they were southeast of here. Yes. By a little stream northeast of Kira. The flowers haven't bloomed yet, but the leaves are a distinctive grey-green. Thank you. Counts that the herbs would be near a little stream. That looks like it. This must be the herbs Lycaon wanted.
Mandrake herbs? Time to go back to the physician. Here, I found your herbs. Thank you. I'll prepare these for my patients. Could you please stay a while? I'll wait. I've crossed the herbs so they'll be easier to take. Could you please bring them to my patients? Just tell them they're for me, Likaun. I thought I brought you more herbs than this. I needed to save a double dose for my grandmother. I'll give it to her soon. Sure. I'll just deliver the rest, then. Thank you. All my patients are in or around the Horal Delphi. One should be at the animal pens to the west. One is building a house in the northeastern corner. And, uh, one works in the fields to the south. Come back here when you're done. I'm sure I can find them. Sends his regards. The medicine he promised. Thank you. Tell me, did he look well? He didn't look sick to me. I've seen him up and walking around at all hours, mumbling to himself. He seems worried. I should bring him some sweets to cheer him up. I'm sure he'd appreciate that. Likaon made this medicine for you. Thanks. See, I take care of these beasts, and Likaon takes care of me. Too bad nobody takes care of him, though. What do you mean? His parents died young. His grandmother raised him, but then... she was born under a cursed star. Never mind that. He's a good boy. I'm sure he is. These herbs are from Glicaon. Oh, thank you! That physician is so thoughtful! And so handsome! It's too bad he's decided not to marry. Why not? He just told me some nonsense about not wanting to burden an innocent woman with his worries. Personally, I just wish he'd been honest and said I'm not his type. I wonder why he'd say that. Need something, statesman? I'm losing everything. Not only was my brother Alpinor murdered, but my whole political career is about to disappear too. Alpinor? Can't say I've heard of him. Alpinor was a kind and wealthy man. He financed my love for politics and protected me from harm. And now he's gone. I risk losing everything I have left. Is there something I can do? Ever since my brother disappeared, bandits have been attacking me. They're after the family fortune, and I'm left defenseless. If they take the money from me, then I can't continue my political career. So you want me to gut every single bandit? The gods show me mercy. That is exactly what I desire. All right, I'm in. Get this done quickly. Here. I delivered all your medicine. Seems you have a lot of people concerned for your well-being. Thanks. Um, my grandmother, Praxithea, I have to bring her the last of the medicine. Will you come along with me to her house? 
I think I need your help. Yes. I'd like to know what's going on here. Oh, thank you. Please, my grandmother's house is this way. Thanks for coming with me. Don't you say you killed many people? Why do you ask me that? If someone is impious to the point of doing grave injustice to people as well as the gods, do they not deserve punishment? What did Praxithea do? She spoke false prophecies for years. Those who came to her for advice received only lies. Your grandmother was an oracle? Yes, up on the hill in Delphi. She confessed to me recently that she never heard the gods and only repeated the words he was told. Told by vile people with evil intentions. Exactly. Wars have been fought over those words. She can't be left unpunished. I... My family was torn apart by a false prophecy. If it was one of hers, I may take matters into my own hands. I know what you want to do. You'll just bring more shame on our family. I don't want to do this, Agavi. But for the sake of justice, we can't let Praxithea live. It's out of our hands anyway. Some strange men were searching the village today, looking for her. I brought them here, and they dragged her away. What kind of justice is that? You won't understand. She was an impious old fool. Now we have nothing more to worry about. Who are you anyway? I'm Cassandra. I've also been wronged by a false prophecy. It might have been your grandmother's. If we don't find her, we can't settle any of this. Please help me figure out where she's been taken. I'll look for clues. What did you expect me to do? All that talk about killing? Praxithea must have lost this bracelet in the struggle. But no ordinary thief would have left something so valuable behind. This looks like a contract. Deliver the package to the drop-off and don't damage it. If they mean Likaon's grandmother, chances are she's alive. Anything strange going on around here? Well, if bandits taking over my cousin's farm is strange, yes. What did they do? Gave her a running start. She can't go back there. They've set up camp, and they're armed and dangerous. Interesting. Where is that farm? It's not far west of here, but I wouldn't mess with those bandits. Thanks for the advice. Praxithea was kidnapped and brought to a farm west of here. The bandits were hired to deliver her alive. Thank you for figuring that out, Cassandra. I'm no fool, Likaon. Your sister put Praxithea in great danger, and you've been asking me about killing. Do you want me to end her life? No. It has to be me. I need to kill her. She's your grandmother, and you're no killer. You should give this more thought. She's my responsibility. I don't want her to suffer. That's why I asked you for Mandrake. It's a painkiller. But for now, will you go to the farm to stop those bandits? I don't think I can take them all on myself. Let's go find Praxithea. Thanks, Cassandra. You said the farm was to the west. I'll meet you there. Come on. Ella.
must be the form of Praxitia is being held prisoner. should be careful. High security here. We must get away from here. Could more bandits be coming? Please, let's get out of here. Thank you for saving me, dear child. Don't thank me, voice of Apollo. 
Or were those someone else's words you spoke? So you've met my grandson. You're right. I lied to everyone. I am so sorry. The gods should have killed me by now. Instead, they made me live with my remorse. Why did you spread lies? People trusted you. You were supposed to bring them the word of Apollo. I didn't plan to, not when I was chosen to be the oracle of Apollo. But I met people there who told me I must speak the words they asked, or else my family would suffer for my disobedience. Family? Do you remember telling a Spartan family that their younger child must die? A grieving mother with eyes like mine. I am so sorry for what you have lost. Who wanted you kidnapped? These brutes didn't come up with the idea themselves. Please, don't ask me that. The ones who want to punish me now, the ones who told me what to say, they would bury you alive if I told you about them. The ones with masks and dark cloaks. The cult of Cosmos. Do not speak their name. Grandmother. Did she tell you? Is she the oracle who brought ruin on your family? I'm sorry for what I've done. I accept my punishment. But please, don't let my grandson kill me. Likaon's a good man, a healer. This would break him. No, this is my responsibility. I must be the one to end her. I've killed enough people to know that violence has no end. Better to move on and make the best of the lives the gods have given you. Move on? But you said Praxithea ruined your family. She can do no more harm. Killing her for revenge won't change what happened. Besides, didn't you tell me something about hope? Thank you for your mercy. I promise I will do good with what's left of my days. You're right, Cassandra. I might not be able to forgive my grandmother, not right away. But she can go on with her life, and I with mine. I think you've made the right decision, Ligaon. Ah, oh, how do you do this? Decide who lives and who dies. How do you do it, Likaun? All those lives depending on you, needing your healing and kindness. I... I, I think I need you, Cassandra. Not to kill anybody or find anything. Just to stay with me. I can't stay forever, but for now, let me take care of you, healer. Αποκτήσα το πολλά τη χρήματα των πρόκειων.
Let's go. Have you killed them? I took care of them. Every last one. Nicely done, my friend. Please, take this as thanks. Thank you. Good news. Found the Zaphires. Should I ask why they're bloody? Well, the priests couldn't cut it as thieves. <laughs> if I were only a little bit younger, I might have tried to cheapen the reward a bit. Good thing you got old. <laughs> Here's a little trinket from the treasury. No one will miss it. Let's hope not, or you'll send another mercenary after me. Goodbye, Photios. <laughs> if you ever see that dog, Marcos, again, <laughs> tell him you demand minimum wage. Τι 
Είστε αυτοί οι όφησεις, ο Χλής. Back. And not a moment too soon. I got what you asked for. Who is this Avxesia? This is the Mystios who's going to reignite our spark, my love. Oh no! We've been through this. I can't satisfy you anymore. You're going to kill me with your lust. Nonsense! I'm going to make you an elixir that will give you the vigor of a man a fraction of your age. God save me! I cannot do this anymore. Your husband is tired. Allow me to satisfy your hunger. I've never been with a mercenary before. Very well. Let's see what you're made of. Did she have fun? That should hold her for a few days at least. Thank you, Mistyus. Here, take this as payment. You've more than earned it. Move!
Be careful not to get spotted. What? Something's over there. I think I'm seeing things. Oh, my God. 
Come on. Anything? Lost any time? Oh, cover! I know where they are firing from. The I arrows are coming from archers. over there. Oh! <laughs> 
Bella.
don't want to be caught here. What? What's going on? Nothing here. That's good. the last battle. The commander is still upset. He thinks we can do better. Oh, yeah? Definitely heard something. Dead, I think. Let me check.
see it coming. Greetings, Spartan. Need something? The eagle-bearing Mystios. I thought you were a legend. Those legends are only stories. I'm just a humble mercenary. I've heard stories about how you worked with the Spartans in Megaris and helped them to victory. I've also heard you have something to do with the wolf's disappearance. You can't believe everything you hear. Sadly, with the wolf gone, fear has spread through our ranks. There's actually a small group of conspirators claiming Nikolaus isn't dead, but a deserter. They're alleging no one's seen his body. <laughs> That's crazy. Everyone knows he's dead. That may be, but these men are convinced. They're deserting their posts and encouraging others to follow. They need to be stopped. You're asking me to kill all the Spartan deserters? All these soldiers must die. Do we have a deal? All right. I'll do it. For Sparta. I'll come back when I'm done. I'll be on high alert here.
You're back. Have you killed them? I took care of them. Every last one. Good. Take this. You earned it. All in a day's work. Phobos. Anything a mercenary can do for you, stranger? I am to be tried, Mystios. Charged with impiety. They say my teachings deny the will of the gods. If true, that is a serious offense. Our lives are guided by the irrational and the unknown, not the divine. My writings explain this wisdom. I fear with my impending trial that my work may not reach the person meant to transcribe it. So you want me to provide protection? That's exactly it. Will you do it for me? You'll be safe with me. You're a That should be the last of them, Mistios. You're quite the warrior. You're safe now. You kept up your end of the deal. Now it's time I hold up mine. Take this. You're strong, capable, and obviously resourceful. I could use someone like you on my crew. What do you say? I'm no sailor mercenary. I prefer to ponder the ocean's depths from the shore. 
You'd have loved Varnavas. But fine. This boat can take those waves. Thank the gods you came. What happened? Where's the rest of your crew? Pirates! They killed most of us, but they took my brother. Please, you must help him. I'll help find your brother, sailor. I'm not a sailor. I'm a carpenter. So is my brother. Our father taught us. Interesting. Our ship could use a carpenter. I've worked as a shipwright. Repaired hulls with holes the size of Poseidon's feast. Please, save my brother, and I'll join your crew. Then it's a deal. Where can we find these pirates? There is an island uh, west of Viotia and south of Mount Helicon. I hear the sail from there. Anything else that might help? I don't know. It happened so fast. Because of the war, there's more pirates about than ticks on a sow these days. But their camp can't be far. We'll find these pirates and rescue your brother.
this world. What in Hades was that? Doesn't look like I'll find out through this door just yet. Maybe another time.
It's a big pig. I should stay hidden if I don't want to fight. Yeah! <laughs> 
Let's hope no one notices me here. Held back to Daphne at the temple. Did you get lost? Here, I killed your piggy for you. Hmm. You are skilled. Of that there is no doubt. I have plenty of talents. Of that you can be sure. Oh, is that so? Well, I look forward to putting them all to the test. Oh? And what did you have in mind? <laughs> Many things. 
But first, to business. There are beasts that roam this world, but are not fully of it. They've been placed here by the gods as trials, as tests. These beasts are creatures like any other. The world is full of mysteries, but not everything unexplained is ordained by the gods. Perhaps before this is over, you will have a different opinion. What exactly do you want me to do? I want you to prove your worth in the eyes of Artemis and hunt these creatures. I don't need to prove my worth to anyone. Just tell me what's the reward. With each pelt you return, I will grant you a boon from Artemis. If you are able to slay all the beasts, well, let's say your relationship with the daughters of Artemis will be forever changed. All right, I'll do it. Now, just how many of these animals are there? Artemis has laid out eight trials, and you have already started the journey. Hunt down those that remain. How will I recognize the creatures? Oh, you'll know. Bring the pelts to me. I'll await your return with my sisters, the daughters of Artemis. I hope you don't make me wait too long to see your face again.
I should try to stay out of sight. Check that out.
Faster.
Malaka, no one here. You're just making me want to kill you for free.
brother is look on your end. Nothing at all. Do not lose your focus. This one is dead. I watch your back.
thing.
Need something, stranger? I have never been so insulted in my life. Those vermin! They profaned my holy songs dedicated to the gods. Slow down! Who insulted you? The military commander hired me to play for his soldiers. They sang along. The most vile things I've ever heard. Profaners. Scum. So you need a mercenary to kill him. It's not an easy task, but yes. The Spartan must be killed. You haven't heard? That's already been taken care of. By me. By Apollo, thank you. This is for you. All in a day's work. Todos. Only for a short trip. I have business to attend to in Athens. Herodotus is helping me find my mother. Seeking help from the gods has put Herodotus on your path, just like they put you on mine. They work in ways beyond our comprehension, and all we can do is follow their lead. You could be right. Herodotus and I share an too. Like in Pinor! He is... was... Part of a very powerful group called the Cult of Cosmos that controls the Greek world through the Oracle. Control the Oracle? Impossible! Apollo would not allow that! Now they're looking for my mother. I need to find her before they do. And I believe they will hurt others or oppose their views along the way. By Hermes! The Oracle lost to corruption and now this cult? Do we know who leads them? I don't know for sure, but... It might be my brother. Tell me about it.
fail you again. They might be dead. I have to check it out. Looks like there was a bounty on your head. She wasn't worth the trouble. My thanks! 
Let's go. For honesty. Don't think they came this way. Keep searching. We'll find them.
They'll be watching for me. I need to be careful.
Someone's down. It was an honor to fight by your side.
Ospen Terosti, le voy a llamar.